We're back at the DNA Technologies stand here on the show floor at MedLab Middle East 2025. Ilya, good to speak with you. Uh, talk to me about, about your role at DNA Technologies and just talk to me about the trends that you're seeing in that area around molecular biology at the moment. No, thank you for your question, David. Uh, as soon as, as I'm involved not only in uh, development of uh, uh, new molecular biology kits, but also in development and production of uh, uh, therapies, of new therapies, I believe um, that uh, now we are on the edge of breakthrough findings, scientific findings, in the field of, uh, field of uh, effective uh, um, targeted therapies. And I believe that um, the next uh, decade will bring us a lot of new uh, findings um, uh, in molecular biology, biology that allow us to make these therapies even more effective. Because as you know, the targeted therapies were good, but uh, it requires some physiological and genetic background. And uh, of course, talking about technology, uh, the technology which lays in the basement of uh, these new findings and these new products uh, is uh, next generation sequencing. Okay, so of course when we're talking about innovation here, a lot of conversations inevitably end up with data and then processing of that data, analytics, artificial intelligence. So as we start to move towards more targeted therapies, more efficient, more efficacious therapies, do technologies like AI help you to analyze, refine and develop the solutions better? Of course, we are quite strong in these fields. Uh, as soon as we are also develop the software, which uh, allows us to deal with the big data. And of course, the next step in the development of, uh, of new approaches will be um, linked to the artificial intelligence. And that is the field where, they, where we want to get new competence and where we want to get uh, the best result. Thank you. Before we go, how, how mature do you feel this market is at the moment? You, you're excited, clearly, by what's just around the corner, but how close is that corner? Are we talking two years? Are we talking ten years? Well, it's unpredictable, actually, David, yes. But uh, I can tell you that artificial intelligence is already here. And I will tell you about artificial intelligence uh, from, the point, from the point of view of a uh, professor in university. You know, my students, uh, they are using, who well, previously make a PowerPoint presentation for a certain theme, was a kind of tricky thing. But now you can create a macros and give it to artificial intelligence, and it will take 15 minutes just to read something about the new field for you and to get a new a perfect presentation yes so that that what students do and uh, I suggest you to imagine what scientists may do with, with these things yeah. thank you very much indeed clearly it's a very exciting area in which you work and I look forward to speaking to you again soon and hearing about where you've got to but for now okay. thank you very much thank you David thank you